Good morning, this is Birdman Mel, and we're doing one last filming today with our Purple Martins. Guys, you guys ready to go traveling with me? I'm getting ready to leave with my family on a vacation where we're going to end up in Panama, and I wish I had enough frequent flyer miles to take these guys because they're going the same direction. Any minute, they're going to say, hey, it's time to start heading back to Brazil. We wanted you to see them. Come on down here, Don. Let's see. Everybody gets to get up and say hello. There they go. Lots of them, some have already left, uh, but these are some of the younger Martins that were some of the late nesters. And uh, before they go, we also wanted to zoom in over here on a new device we have to talk about some ways we took care of the Martins this summer that we haven't done in the past. First thing I'm gonna start out with is a new feeding tray system. The other trays, there's some good ones out there, but they you know, they get wobbly, they're hard to get up and down. We tested this year, one that's made out of recycled plastic with a metal bottom on it. And this worked very good. It gave us lots of drainage. And uh, we, what do we use this tray for? Well, we originally put nesting material in it. We fed mealworms, live mealworms to the Martins and also calcium supplements. You're gonna see this box here and say, what are you doing? Well, what this was, and you can tell it was used by uh, left a little bit behind there. You have jumpers that come this time of year, what, and those are martins that prematurely jump out of the nest. It happens once in a while. My first preference is to put them up into the house, the cavity where they came from, but if other martins have not quite fledged by moving the house up and down, you cause more jumpers. So I like to have a place to put that baby martin where mom can come and find him and feed him and give him a day or two more to get his wings and to get going. And we did that this year with, with a lot of success. One or two guys just didn't seem to get it. They would keep jumping. Uh, but I do believe we fledged four or five extra Martins by doing that. You're gonna say, well, what kind of box is that? Well, we simply used a product we already had here. It's a bluebird feeder. Uh, and we pulled the front plexi out. You'll notice it's faced north. It's important that you keep the Martins out of the hot sun. They're used to sticking their head out of the holes in the house. So that's why I went ahead and used this. It was funny, they'd sit here and mom would come feed them. So we're gonna try to catch that on film next year. The other thing that happened is we had hawks come by. I keep bottle rockets and, and uh, Roman candles around and uh, I find they're a safe way to uh, give the hawk a little encouragement not to hang out in our part of the world. Last but not least, I wanted to remind you as you look at the houses, you'll see the doors are open. In each of those is a nesting tray. And uh, if we can zoom in on this nesting tray here in my hand, the nesting tray they have built here, I really like these. They have a little bar in them, and the baby martins actually do some exercises in there, the cameras have showed, before they come out on the porch. But uh, they'll make it very easy for us to take the martin nest out, clean the house, disinfect it, and that's what I want to emphasize, is the minute the martins are gone, uh, and for sure gone, I may leave one or two holes open for other martins that come by to check us out, but the majority of them I clean and shut because I don't want the houses to become a sparrow or a starling castle the rest of the year. The other thing you can easily do is just turn this around backwards, slide it in, it blocks the hose so they can't come in. So guys, I want to say goodbye. I hate to see you go, but I got a feeling when I get back from vacation, they're going to be down there. So to next year, this is Mel talking about Purple Martins, and we'll film them when they come back approximately next March 6th to the 10th. Have a great day.